All right, let's do it. We did get Armand, but for the first game, we're not going to use any like new perks or anything. I just want to get this video out as soon as possible. Show you guys the new Survivor. It does look really cool as well with his long hair. Looks a little bit like The Undertaker from wrestling. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully um, a bit of gameplay looping the new killer as well. He can shapeshift into a wolf and bats. Um, and he also has like a ranged fire attack as well. Really good time for DBD right now. Five Nights at Freddy's just got announced yesterday. I think we're getting that next year at some point. And then obviously Castlevania right now as well. So really exciting time. Where is he? There he is. He's taking the form of bats right now. Let's do it. Let's jump on that. There's his ranged fire attack that he just went for. There he is. The vampire himself. Now he's in the furry mode. <laughs> we've got quite a lot of furry options in DBD now, haven't we? We've got those furry skins that they added. Now we've got this guy. It kind of reminds me of that. Any of you guys played Zelda Twilight Princess? Kind of reminds me of that, how you transform into Wolf Link. About to be another gen down, though. Looking good for gen speed. He's not got any hooks yet. I did play one game before this, and literally no one was doing gen, so it's always good to see. Good gen speed on a PTB. There's only two of us playing as, um, as this new guy as well. I haven't played any of the Castlevania games. I played like a little bit of Symphony of the Night, but that's about it. Maybe I will get around to playing them at some point though. I definitely want to get a physical copy of Symphony of the Night. It is crazy expensive though on the PS1, but I will get around to getting it eventually when I find one for a good price. I think we'll be taking Chase now as well. I hope so. Come on, Dracula. Oh, is he not moving in? No, nah, he is moving in. Okay, fair enough. Come on now. Let's play Balance Landing straight away. Oh, wait, he stopped to kick that. It doesn't really matter, though. <laughs> can the bats attack us? I assume they can, right? Surely. I know the wolf can definitely attack you. I'm not too sure about the bats yet, though. Like I said, I've not really played against them much. Even last game, I was kind of just doing gens. I didn't really take chase. She's in a pallet here. Let's hopefully... Yeah, we should be able to just get picked up. Not, nah, he's going back in for it. Wait, he can't pick up if we're around, obviously. Oh, I got stuck. Wait, what? Why is there a fence there? <laughs> Come on, let's hopefully take chase. It's about time we had a chase. And they can get the slug up as well. That'll be perfect. Going for that range attack there. We could have played window, but I just don't know how good that range attack is. If he could have got us through the window. You can see he's holding it there, I think. He's got, like, fire in his hand. If we vault early, though, we should be fine. He's going to go for a vault himself, though. Okay, I think he used it, which means it'll probably be on cooldown, I assume. Should be able to make it back around for the window, yeah, easily. What? <laughs> Was that part of his... Is that like part of his power or something? Or is that just insanely high ping? Lara's medkit's broken there as well. <laughs> Alright, that last chance about to pop, so it would be good to take an M1 here. We can get that adrenaline. Do it. There it is. Uh, maybe I should have saved. It's too late now, though. There's the fire. Wait, so is it not like in a straight line? Does it kind of just go everywhere? All right, we should have everyone out then, hopefully. We're just gonna... We should have double healed. I don't know why she went in for the gate. Yeah, you can have the... Uh, he's coming back. He's in the wolf farm. He's the fairy right now. DBD fairy edition. Let's get to that gate. Yui, come take hit for us. Why are you just standing there? We should be fine anyway, though. We've got a lot of distance. Yeah, he's gone into the bat there. Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> we're going to leave there. GG's, GG's. Good first game. Our first game for the YouTube anyway. Like I said, I did play one before this and it didn't go too good because no one was on gems. <laughs> oh, he is definitely moving in. He's right there, isn't he? Okay, there he is. The fairy. Let's balance landing away. <laughs> Wretched fate. So that's the new hex perk, I think, where... Oh, yeah. Okay, we... Yeah, we, we're the obsession. We need to go find it. We're the obsession. We suffer from... A it's like 36 or something. 36% gen slowdown. Um, and you, but you do see the aura of the totem when you're within 12 meters. So we definitely need to go find that. That's going to take us too long to do gens. Oh, wait. The killer's right here, though. The bats. Okay, why is he going down there? He's going down there maybe to check on something. So that means the totem could be down there. I thought we went for, far enough for the 12 meters, but maybe not. Let's see. We'll have a look when we... Uh, when we do lose chase and when he does drop chase we can do one more hopefully bit greedy but we should be okay did he double back he did double back which means we can now make window which is perfect we know for the vault as well we'll move back onto that pallet we can definitely do one loop here at least 
Yeah, you can take it this time. Ooh, there's the range attack, so it's a little bit like Pyramid Head. How come last game it was kind of all over the place then? Oh, he's back in the ferry. Come on then, wolf. Let's have a little chase. Gonna hold us here. The mind games. Can go into that and break it in the power. Okay, fair enough. Good to know. Three gens left her. We can either play jungle gym or TLs. Then we'll do jungle gym again. Coming from this side. A little bit of respect on the pallet. Mm, you can have it this time. Watch out for that range attack though. There it is. So yeah, very similar to Pyramid Head. Um, that may have been an add-on last game. How it was like all over the place. I'm not entirely sure. You guys can let me know if any of you guys know yet. Wait, I lost him. There he is. God, how close was that? Let's move back onto this. This is going to definitely be a lot safer, isn't it? Probably going to break it in the power. With the furry there. There was no noise on that vault as well, so I don't know if that's a bug or what. Bad move by me. I should have played window. We might make TL, though. Yeah, I went for the charge attack. All right, we can get away now. Two gens left. Looking really good. We are moving to a place with no pallet, though. We did use this earlier. Just going to go for the vault. We might be able to get away. Do we make that? Okay, well, he mind-gamed it, so we make it easily now. I think we would have made it regardless, though. Another hex put it down. Love to commit this guy as well. I love to see that. I think he's got us here, though. No, maybe not. He went for the power again. Gonna play window. Gonna go for the little vault in the furry once again. Loves the furry, this guy. Gonna pre drop that. Oh, we did feed him it, unfortunately. Might make window again, though. Yeah, we do. He does not want to leave us, does he? Well, if we can last one more gem, we will get adrenaline, but we are on our last legs there, I think. Uh, bad movement by me. Let me go back. Nah, it didn't work. All right, one gen left, though. We will definitely take that. Very good chase there. Love the look of him as well. He does look really cool. If we can see him. He's too tall to kind of see, isn't he? Look how tall he is. <laughs> he is massive. There we go. We kind of seen him a little bit there. But yeah, seems like a really fun killer. I do like the shapeshifting abilities and everything. I'm not going to... I've not tried him out myself yet, obviously. Because I do want to get this video out. But I'll definitely give him a go later. Oh, look at that castle as well. Yeah, I heard something like you can see the castle on all of the maps. So it's kind of like alien. How do you know like the hooks are different? Kind of similar thing with this. So if you see the alien hook, you know it's alien. Same thing with this there. Like if you see that, you know it. it's Dracula. Same thing with Freddy as well. If you see like the alarm clocks and pig as well, stuff like that. And also the timer with Freddy. So that's another thing. But yeah, that's really cool. Like you see that huge castle there. We should probably be over there taking a hit for him really because we do have adrenaline. He is moving in though. Here he is. Good hit in the power there. If we can bait him away, they can go back for it. We've got that adrenaline. Perfect. That power will be on cooldown, I assume, so we don't have to worry about it right now. I don't know if he can actually attack you in the bats. I've not seen it yet, so I, I'm not entirely sure. Let's just keep moving. Boom, there it is. There's the adrenaline. We'll hold forward, create as much distance as possible. It's not as much as it used to be, is it? from five seconds to three seconds but we'll still take it better than nothing definitely i think he's dropping here as well i think he's going in for the gate maybe i think the injured guy's on the other gate he definitely wouldn't still be on that might be moving back in though yeah back on us there it seems not sure where the other gate was okay he is moving in for that guy there where was the other gate let's go find it has been open now as well all right we need to maybe take a hit for this guy okay yeah the gate's over there i just seen the red on the, the door okay where did this guy go okay there he is yeah, he's fine. He should make that. We're here for a body block as well, maybe. Uh, we can't get in front in time. Yeah, he's fine, though. He's out there. All right, there we go, then. Four man out. We will take it once again. GG's. All right, here he is. The wolf straight away. There's no window there, is there? All right, we do avoid that. Wait, do we avoid that? Okay, so he gets, like, two pounces. I thought it was only one. All right, but he, do he does have two. Good to know. We'll keep that in mind. Let's play the window here. To start us off. We don't need to drop it yet. We can do one more. Double back? Yeah, double back. 
think we can also... No, nah, we need to get that down. We definitely need to. I did want to agree and play window, but when he started going for the pounds, we do need to get it down. Otherwise, we would have been dead there. He played it really well. We can also play balanced land in here. If he is going for us, or is he going for the... Okay, well, if he's going for the other guy, we could start the heal, I guess. Let's do it. Kind of hijacked the chase there, didn't he? <laughs> I don't mind, though. It is what it is. We get to safety and we get to heal up. I want to see a legendary skin for Alucard as well. I'm, like I said, I've not played much Castlevania, but the one I have played is Symphony of the Night, so you play as Alucard in that game. I definitely would like to see a skin for him. Like, he's my favorite one. I played a little bit of um, a little bit of the Castlevania characters in Smash Bros. as well. I think it's Simon and Richer in those games. I'm sure we'll see those guys as legendary skins as well. I think Simon is the most famous, isn't he? Maybe Richer, I'm not sure. I think it's Simon, though. Remember um, Castlevania 2, Simon's Quest? I mean, I never played it myself, but I remember hearing about that game. There he is. Yeah, I actually don't think the bat can attack you, you know? I think the bat is just for mobility. I mean, I don't know, though. I could be wrong. I've not really played against him much yet. I didn't read over his power, either. Not yet. Like I said, I just wanted to get this video out for you guys as quickly as possible. Let's give him that stun there, then we can move. Let's see if he wants to commit as well. Yeah, it looks like he does. God pilot has been used. We'll keep that in mind. This is why I love Windows so much. Like, people say it's a beginner perk. It's really not a beginner perk. If you're playing solo queue, it's so helpful. And even in a Swift as well, unless you're, like, really good at communicating and remembering what pilots have been used, still really good as well. And it's also good to know which spawns you got. Like, sometimes when you're taking chase, you don't know which side the pilot's on or whatever on a lot of maps. It's great for beginners as well, though, of course. But it's not solely a beginner perk. All right, if we take chase, we can play balance landing on the rock. Let's do it. Are we going to make that? Maybe not, especially with the pounds. Nah, we should be fine now. Let's do it. Let's get away. Watch out for the pounds, though. There it is. Nice. Okay, so I, he gets two, right? Let's keep moving. Back in the Dracula farm. Good hit there. Hex totem as well. We're moving on to an area with no pilots, unfortunately. Maybe a bad movement by me. We'll see how it goes. Okay, he pulled up the power there, so we can maybe make it over to a different jungle gym. Let's do it. Still committing to this side. Really good hit with the power, though, played. All right, let's double up on this. We'll get our adrenaline. There is a slug over there. Hopefully, he's got adrenaline as well. No, oh, Mori. Okay, well, it doesn't matter if he's got adrenaline, then. Hit them greats as well. That's going to help us. Oh, he's in chase with the other guy, so it's fine. Where's the gates? There's one just down here. Let's get this open straight away. Pushing us off it, I think. Yeah, he's in the wolf. The furry mode. All right, we do get away from that. Can't play balance landing, which is unfortunate. I would love to do balance there, but we did use adrenaline, so we can't. Here's dropping chase, though. Going for the other guy. The um, Our other teammate's on the other gate, though. Where that is, I'm not entirely sure. Wait, wasn't it down here? Yeah, it was down here, actually. I remember seeing it was down here. Uh, that guy's second hook. It's going to be a hard save, I think, though. Oh, wow. They're both there. What do we even do here? Okay, that's the gate they was on, actually. They were both committing to that one. That's a bad move. All right, we'll see if we can save. We'll see if we can be the hero. We need to get over there quick, though. Yeah, we definitely do. This guy needs to take an endurance hit. Although he is death hook. Yeah, there we go. Waiting out the endurance. Uh, no, okay, he's not waiting out the endurance. We're not going to vault that because he's probably going to go for the fire. Yeah, I did go for the fire. We're just going to move down here. He is going back. All right, they did get the save. We're just opening this and we're going to get out. We definitely need to. Otherwise, we're going to end up throwing this hand in my 4K. Let's do it. Let's get it open. Oh, he's got another guy there as well, which means he'll probably go into the bat and head in down for this gate. Oh, he's not picking up straight away. He's going for the slug. That should give us enough time to get this open then, hopefully. That's if he is looking for the other guy. Yeah, he is looking for the other guy. All right, we're getting this open and we are leaving. There's nothing we can do there whilst injured. GG's. That's going to be the end of the video as well, guys. Like I said, I do just want to get this video out straight away. But hope you guys have enjoyed it. Let me know what you think of the Castlevania chapter in the comments down below. And as always, I will see you all next time.